do? Hello? Hello, hello. I'm gonna sound a little off here for a second. Turn this down. All right, my controller volume is on, so I have to figure this out. How's everybody doing? Press any button. All right, all right, all right. Uh, 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 pull up my own stream here so I can actually see the chat. Hopefully you guys are all doing good today. It's probably going to be a bit smaller of a, of a crowd today since I doubt anyone knows what Astro's Playroom really is. I think it's really cute though. Hey everybody, hey Voltage. Mandalorian 637, do you want a PS5 review? Like I can do one. I could do one. I'm not sure if people will uh, care or not, but but I am doing good voltage. Too indecisive to pick a name. Average is better than bad. Uh, where did my cords go? I'm struggling here. They were in the other room. Welcome to Astro's Playroom. The game that you promised to stream, and now you're just sitting here messing with chords. Oh, super chat from Jill. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. You guys want a PS5 review? I can definitely do one. So, the thing is, uh, you know, it, uh, oh, jeez. Oh, this is really cool. It's going through all the PlayStations? That's awesome. Introducing the DualSense controller. Yeah. We'll show you the vibration. Now, wh why don't you just sit on it for, uh, you know, uh, just uh, just try it out. Just just sit on the controller, we'll show you the vibration. Oh, that's pretty cool. Wait, will it just do a little? Yeah, I'm like way too easily amused, guys. You guys have no idea. Uh... Wow, this is a loud controller. I kind of want to turn off this. Okay, I already did adaptive triggers, touchpad, got it. Can I do six, nine? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Uh, motion sensor, okay. Well, I guess I guess this would be a good way to uh, test the or use for the um, review, wouldn't it? Microphone. Hello, hello. Hello, it is me, your overlord. I'm a globe. They're the globalists. They're coming for you. All right, let's go. This is pretty cool. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, gesture of genocide. I'm a little too easily amused. Sorry. <laughs> I guess it's better than uh, better than being apathetic. I suppose. All right, I'm not sure if this, uh, if my controller sound effects are gonna bother anyone, so we'll just kind of see how loud it is. How, uh, how is the stream sounding to you guys, by the way? Is uh, the audio good? Huh. Interesting. Okay. Oh, there's Astro. Aww. I find this character really cute. Cabbage Farmer 69 is always funny. Alright, so what am I doing here? Just running around? So this game is packaged in with every PlayStation 5. It's just a free thing you download. And uh, normally I would think it would be lame and not developed, but it's actually really cute and it's fun. X... Oh, you want me to do that? Okay. You use the lasers to destroy that. Perfect. I also heard that there is tons of Easter eggs in this. Aw. All right, what am I doing here? Do I plug in? Oh, okay. So a square, pull, pull it. You guys have no idea how much nicer this controller is than the DualShock 4. I like the DualShock 4 a lot, but this thing is top tier. Absolutely top tier. 
Audio's fine, thank you. Good, good, I'm glad to hear it. I'm actually, if that is true for once, then we're doing good. What do the mods think? Oh, that's classic PlayStation. Yeah, also, sorry I was late to the uh, stream. I was kind of gooping. So, just so you know, I figured you needed that. I figured you needed that uh, little piece of info. Oh, it's a classic PlayStation. Ah, so cute. Oh, no, it opened. No, I don't want to go in. Do I want to go in? Can I burn this? I can move it. This is literally adorable for a free game. Oh my gosh. Oh, so by the way, um, I am s not streaming. I am doing a Let's Play of uh, Miles Morales and of Demon Souls on the PS5. Those are starting, here's the thing, over on the Let's Play channel, which is in the description, one of them is either starting tonight and one of them tomorrow morning, or they are both starting tomorrow because I've had the most ridiculous time with copyright stuff dealing with uh, dealing with Spider-Man for no reason. Because apparently it's Insomniac's new kink to just throw in uh, a copyrighted... I'm going to get in the middle of this. Oh, it's Spyro! Ah! So apparently it's, it's Insomniac's kink to just throw in copyrighted music at the beginning of the game. One song. It has to be one song only. Oh, that's cute! And uh, I have to now edit that out. And it's been editing online in the YouTube editor for, I think, 10 hours now. Uh, and I have no idea when it's going to be done. Oh, cool. So I'm just kind of waiting for that to happen. Um, and if it doesn't finish today, I have to re-upload it myself by scratch and re-edit it. And hope that I can just remove that myself. So that'll either be up today or tomorrow. We will, we will see. Also, I am trying to pay attention to the chat, so it's just me today. No Nate, sorry about that. Uh, hey, Backporch, what is Bugsnax? I've, I've seen Alex from Podcast Now cover it a little bit, who I also love working with, great creator. Um, will you do a Let's Play of the original or the remaster Spider-Man? Uh, so that's from LEGO. Yes, I plan to do a Let's Play of the original, however, I don't know when. <clears throat> We don't really like playing games back to back. Uh, wait, what am I supposed to do? Oh, oh! Wait, so I pull. Oh! Oh, okay. What'd I get? Crush it, come on. There we go. What is it? How do I see what this is? Clothes? I don't know. So this must be some kind of... Oh! Oh, cool! PSP GPS receiver. Dude, I love this. This is like... Xbox needs a game like this. Come on. Now, I know that in a way it's just commercialized capitalism or whatever. They're, you know, kind of... Oh, I don't have any more. They're just kind of, you know, doing their thing and celebrating their product. But it's so cute and fun. And there's so many cool things you can do with Xbox as well. The original Xbox, the 360. It'd be hilarious if there was a Red Ring of Death mission or something. It'd be awesome. Don't you guys agree, doesn't Xbox need more stuff like this? Uh, Ethan, I really like the PS5. I really like it. However, uh, I haven't played it much. I really have not had time. All right, let's see what this is. So we got their building that looks like PlayStations here, kind of. Um, this guy is looking at Dinosaur Rule 34. It's like, really, he's, and he's actually analyzing. He's like, okay, these are the feet. I'm a feet guy. I love that. And the chin, the under chin, I love that. I'm a bike guy. What is this? Can I break this? Can I abuse this man? I guess I could. Okay, maybe we should move on. Oh, wait, is this a PSVR? No. Oh, no, that's my... That's my GPS thing. Cool! Okay. Sorry. Very excited. I, I When I popped this in, I was like, oh, it'll probably be kind of neat. Yeah, it'll probably be fun. Now I'm just like, oh, Astro's Play Rob! PlayStation Labo? Okay, wait. Map. Map. So, 
Network speedrun. Isn't this where I already went? The PlayStation Labo? No, that's down there. Huh, okay. Well, we'll try to figure this out. Maybe I wasn't paying attention. Uh, oh, Ismail, I ordered it from Target, but then it came weird, like not on time, and then I had to trade a friend for one he had so that I could use it for work. Will I do a Let's Play on the PSP Voltage? You know, I uh, I would love to play through Crisis Core Final Fantasy VII eventually, but I don't know how to legally do it. I, I'm pretty careful with that stuff. I don't like doing like emulation and stuff that's not legal because... I don't really like opening myself up to the problems that come with it or can come with it. And the issue with uh, games on the PSP is almost all of them are only available on the PSP. And in terms of the games I'd want to play, other than Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker, which came to PS3. Um, so it's kind of, oh, come on, ah, oh, dang it. It's kind of an issue because I'd like, I'd like to play those games, but for some reason PlayStation just has abandoned them and never done anything with them again. And now I really don't think they will with something like Crisis Core because um, I don't know how much you guys know about Final Fantasy 7, but there's no reason for them to re-release Crisis Core because the remake is in its new timeline, and why would they promote the old timeline, I guess? I, I don't know. I feel like it would just cause market confusion, so I just don't expect it. But maybe I'll be proven wrong, I don't know. I hope so. All right, what do, what do I do here? Can I just walk on this? Oh, cool. All right, we had to cross this. Pull. Nice. Uh, get over here. Hopefully the uh, controller audio is not annoying anybody. You guys will just have to tell me, I guess. Because there might be a way to turn it off. I don't know. It's really cool though, this whole thing is kind of a tech demo for the controller and what the system can do. And I gotta be honest, I, everyone's gonna be like, oh what? But to me this is like as fun as something, even like Miles that I've already played quite a bit of. This is a game that clearly a lot of effort went into. I'm not saying it's the same thing, but I'm just saying to me it's really fun just like that. All the games I've played so far have been fun. and. Um, I have played through, or I've played some Demon Souls, Miles Morales, and this. I also have Godfall, which I bought kind of as a backup in case this was boring somehow, uh, but it's not, so I don't even know if we'll get to that today. Maybe I'll stream that a different day. But I did buy some games to hopefully kind of, you know, can I get off of this? To just kind of mess around with G CPU jungle, or GPU jungle, I can't read. Let's head through here. All right, the chat. Uh, Young Bounty, I love the PS5 controller. There is a streaming feature back porch on the PS5, but it's not, I don't trust it because the way that they do a lot of this stuff is certain things get blocked. So it'll be like, hey, uh, by the way, you can't stream during this cutscene because the developer said it's a spoiler. So I don't really trust that thing. I just use my own software. Um, Cal, you are right. Square Enix does not have a history of caring about market confusion, but they also don't have a history of caring about old games. So let's think about the old games that they care about. They ported them lazily to Steam. I love Square. I feel like I'm stepping on toes here, but they ported them to stream Steam with almost no changes. And then other than that, they also have basically just re-released 7, 8, and 10. And that's it. They just leave everything else. Lego Kitty is doing fine. We found out she had a urinary infection. Um, Cal, I agree. Limited streaming is silly. Oh, the buddy! I'm gonna kill it. Get back here! <laughs> I'm gonna kill you! Get back here! This is American. Americans finding. Wait, I mean, Europeans finding America. Oh, what a cute animal. Time to kill it. Hunt! Lost hunt. Can I destroy? All right, I feel bad for these animals, but I need your coins. You'll live. Oh, what's down here? Oh, wait, does that crash? Dude! 
Oh, they're recording a crash thing. Oh, that's cute. Oh, it's crash. Dude, I love this game. I absolutely love this game. And I, you know what? I don't care what you say. Crash Bandicoot and Spyro are PlayStation icons. I don't care that they came to Xbox. And I like Xbox, but come on. That'd be like putting Master Chief on the PlayStation. Get out of here. Get out of here. I need my uh, compartmentalized commercialism to remain intact and elitist. Uh, Alright, what is this going to be? Oh. Oh. Alright, get the PS coins. Head down here. What are these guys doing? Oh, that's... Is that supposed to be Aloy? <laughs> this guy is just loving it. He's like, yeah, beat her all! Man. What a dysfunctional world. What's this? What's going on here? What? Oh. Okay. I guess I'm kind of confused. Oh, so he's... Oh, look at this! Guys, look at this! So he's building it with the little controller. Oh, that's cute. Is that a P... Oh, that's a DualShock 4. Let's... Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Oh, that's awesome. What does this guy have? Just a camera? Alright. Move on. I'm gonna be just digging into every single, uh... I don't know, whatever you call it, Easter egg here. Oh, I have to blow on the controller. Okay, this is really cool. <laughs> I feel like I'm playing the DS. Um... NP, yes, I do drop by the Discord, but I have social anxiety and a lot of problems, so I uh, have not been there in a few days. It's kind of my bad. <laughs> Cal Christopher Columbus Simulator. Uh, dude, Cal, you know what game they really don't care about that I want to play? Is Final Fantasy VI. Now, I can play these games on a PC, but you gotta be honest, there's certain games like Final Fantasy or Kingdom Hearts, it just doesn't seem the same to play it on a PC. Maybe that's weird to say, but there's just certain things. Oh, this is cool, the PS Move controller! Ah! Ah. <laughs> oh my gosh. I have the biggest smile on my face. I'm like a kid in a toy store. Alright, what is it? Do I have to... Oh, I probably have to blow... I have to blow that again. Is this Vincent Valentine's coffin? Oh, who is that? Oh, is that... Oh, is that Castlevania? Aww. I love it. I want to live in this world. Guys, the grass has triangles! The grass has triangles! I didn't see- Oh, he waved at me! Did you see that? He waved? Ah! Wait, how do I- It's not working. People are gonna think I'm doing something else in my room. Am I doing something wrong here? Oh. Look at the light. It falls just right. My shadows they please beneath the trees. But none of these things happen for free. Yeah, all that you see rendered by me. I synthesize and rasterize immaterial things that I fabricate for you. For you, yes, I tessellate and animate these dancing sprites. And sunlit skies for you. I do it for you. I'm your GPU. GPU, tell me what to do and I'll do it for you. Yeah, I don't think I can go through there yet. Must be something else you have to do above, I don't know. Uh, chat. Oh wow, we have some super chats. Hey, thank you very much, sorry I missed them. Uh, Grumpy Waluigi, I know it ain't much, but just wanted to support the channel and say thanks for the fun on the Discord. Hey man, thank you very much. I'm glad you're having fun on the Discord. I hope to see you there more. I appreciate it. NP, it's all good man, I love your channel and look forward to watching you grow in the future. Thank you very much, you guys are really nice. You guys are really nice. I appreciate it. Yeah, Foster Boy, thank you for pointing that out. I need to pay attention to the chat more. That's why we need Nate. I mean, as much as an e of an Igor and special person he is, uh, he can help watch the chat. It's a real shame that he's not here. Him and I have been very busy with the Let's Play channel, so I will have to see if he can be here next week, but if he can't, maybe I will just play Godfall by myself, and we'll have him back in a couple weeks on the uh, streams. What is this? Ooh. Alright. 
Pull out of that. Perfect. Is it all just one coin? Oh. Nice. Okay. What are these guys doing? Oh, they're just catching the butterfly. That's cute. Pull on this. Here we go. The path to progression. Oh, no. I'm really surprised this was free. Who is that? Oh, that's Bloodborne! Ah, that's Bloodborne! I'm standing in the picture. Who took a picture of me? Why not? Here. Aiming right here? Nope, too high. Right there, take the picture there. Nope, too high? Right there. There you go, perfect. Ow! He hits me? I'll hit you back, dude. I like how they're loving it. They're like, yeah, abuse that man! Hit him! That's so cool, though. He has, like, the trick weapon. I don't remember which one that is, but I it's just the classic one. Does he... Oh, he does. He does transform it out. Okay. I love this. Let's head up here. Alright. Get rid of those guys. Uh, what is this? Oh! Oh! Oh, I see. It's kind of like a Zelda-ish thing. These are discs. Guys, this might be the cutest game I've ever played. Oh, okay. I gotta time that better. How do I get up there? Oh, you can't do it well. Okay. I have really bad timing. Holy cow. Okay. Is there a way to get higher on this? Oh, it must not spin again. Okay. But I just did it right and it didn't spin. So that must just be all it does. Go up these discs. Perfect. Over here. Please do some coins! Beat up this man. Actual question, what is the most adorable game you've played? I know a lot of people, it's Big Planet. Or Little Big Planet. Big Planet. Big Planet's the dollar store knockoff from China. Alright, what does this do? Oh, just one, okay. So this should be a big one that, oh no. Maybe now? No, I guess not, okay. Well, I still got some. Uh, anything over here? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Do Hello, Sa uh, is it Sasuke or Sasku Saskui? Hello. Astro for PlayStation mascot. I agree, Trent. He's adorable. Look at this man. I'd buy a Funko Pop of him. I'm playing this with one hand now so I can look at the chat. Sorry. Uh, Nate should write a book called Funny. Well, it keeps funny. That's his game. Or his book. Grumpy Waluigi, go, go grow home. Why can't I talk? Holy cow, guys. Blood Demon Guy, I did get the PS5 by pure luck. Pure, pure luck. Animal Crossing, that's a good... That's a good cute game. I played some of uh, New Leaf. Oh, guys, it's the controller! Or it's the... It's the, uh, triggers... Okay, I would love it if they made more of these games. I would I would seriously pay for one of these. Okay, let's pull this. Nice. Nice. What's going on over here? Who's this? Who's that supposed to be? I guess I don't really recognize this one. Maybe someone else will recognize it. I feel like I should. I know what this is. Huh. Oh, oh no! Okay, well. I guess I don't know what to do with those. Maybe there's a way to shoot? Hmm, alright. 
Take all those guys out. Perfect. Let's just head this way. Oh, okay. So I'm holding on here. Two, then one, and... Perfect. Guys, it is a wonderful Saturday. Couldn't remember the day. Do you have any fun plans today? Oh, that was a clicker from The Last of Us? Oh, I can see it. I didn't, I couldn't tell. Okay, that's cool. I honestly could not tell. We are at 100 people right now. Yeah, we do want to do a uh, Lego Let's Play for real. Nate is at home. Mr. President, Nate is at home. Where are you? I thought you were doing the recount. Uh, ooh. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, okay, so I can throw this. Can I get another one? Thank you. Thank you, PlayStation. Very cool. So now I need to get out there. How far can my jump take me? Let's just do a little test. I really don't trust that, but okay. Oh, jeez, okay. Barely. Oh, no! Okay, so this is The Last of Us. I couldn't tell, but you're right. Yeah, because those are mushrooms. I thought this was flowers. Do they have little eyes on them? Oh, that's kind of cute. Dun, dun, dun. Dude, I could vibe out to this music. I feel like I'm back at a college party. Alright. Let's head this way. Alright, we made it to the checkpoint. What's going on down here? Oh, it's Uncharted. Okay. That's cool. I was trying to tell who this or who that was, but I think that's Nathan Drake. Uh, okay. Destroy. I'm definitely gonna get the platinum on this game. This is so fun. Holy cow. Alright, is there a way to get up here? Maybe I have to go around? A lot of checkpoints here. Ah, oh, no! Jeez. Alright. Can I... Oh. I just got one-shotted. Well. That was something. Okay, we'll move inside. Oh no. Okay. This guy decided to follow me. <clears throat> um... What is a good Batman Arkham game to play once I beat Arkham Knight? Uh... Well, have you, have you not played any of them? I mean, because I would probably... I would have started at Asylum, then done City, Origins, Knight, but if Knight is the only one you played, I would just go back and play them in order. You'll still understand them. But uh, everybody here has their own opinion for sure. Yasmin, you're awesome. Thank you, I appreciate it. Is it, uh, is it pronounced Yasmin or Jasmine? Apologies. I'm really bad at names. I was a teacher and I was awful at it and everybody got mad at me. So then I just kind of started saying their names wrong to make fun of them, and they thought that was funny. Alright, how do I take this guy out? Oh no! Okay. Oh! So I'm just gonna have to get out of there. And then pull the plug, I got it. Move to the side. Low canister, my old friend. You missed me again. Because this Meta Knight discount knockoff is softly creeping. Okay. Nice. Okay, he's gone. Perfect. Perfect. What is this? Oh, just pine cones? Alright. Uh, uh, uh. Doing my best to watch the chat as well. Doing my best. Robin with chopsticks. Jay, I just want to say that I respect you for talking about the Johnny situation. You're a really cool guy. 
Oh, thank you, Ramen. I appreciate it. I, uh... Not physical, but I experienced, uh, something very similar in terms of, uh, emotional abuse like that. And I, uh, I never felt like I could talk about it, and it really bothered me, and the Johnny situation really upset me because the man is not perfect. No one is. Like, I, I totally accept it, you know, pe pe everybody's like, well, he's not perfect. It's like, well, yeah, for sure. I mean, you know, I, I don't think he would claim to be. He knows that there's things that are not perfect and he's a I, I think it bothers me because um okay, how do i climb this it bothers me because everybody's using things like his problem of addiction against him and but if i pull this if i pull this all it does is grab this and they aren't considering that for amber or considering that maybe his addiction is a symptom of the pain that he's dealing with, you know? Like, a lot of people... Okay, let me go up, man. Uh, what am I not understanding here? A lot of people fall to that because of being in emotional pain and hanging on to... that sort of thing. I cannot go up, and I'm very confused. Oh, I have to reach with the... Con oh, okay. I guess that really bothers me. I saw a clip that literally made me cry. It was Johnny Depp as Jack Sparrow at a children's hospital. And it was after his finger had gotten uh, hurt. And the child asked him what happened to his finger. And he said, oh, I was hungry, so I bit it off. As like a joke in character as Jack Sparrow. It's like, this man is so nice. I, I don't know. It just really bothers me, guys. I know I'm like one person. I can't do anything about it, but it really upsets me. And it upsets me that people are like, Amber Heard's pretty and a woman, so she couldn't have done anything. Because that kind of attitude is how people just let others get away with abuse. It reminds me of, like, it reminds me of the South Park skit where um, a teacher gets with a student, and everyone's like, oh, nice, because it's a woman teacher. But if it was a man teacher, they'd throw him in prison. So, I don't know. To me, I, I'm just tired of the double standards. Either you hold people accountable, or you don't, you know? You don't hold some people accountable and ignore what other people have done. Um, and I work with W... Or I have worked with WB. I'm not a member of the company. And I understand that it might hurt my relationship with them to talk out about that stuff. But them firing him from Fantastic Beasts was such a bad move. Like, it looks so awful for them. And I know for me, like, not to call for boycotts. You guys should do whatever you want with your money. You should not do something because I do it. But I'm not going to pay to see Fantastic Beasts or Pirates of the Caribbean without Johnny Depp. I'm just not going to. Um, I'm going to vote with my wallet. I disagree with their decisions, so I'm not going to enable it. Okay. I feel like I'm missing a lot. Okay, this is the most impressive controller game I've ever played. Alex told me that, and I thought he was just kind of, not like making it up, but I thought he was exaggerating. I, th I was like, oh, well, how? You know, how How would it be impressive? But this, this thing really takes advantage of the whole thing. Like, you can't see it right now, but I'm shaking the controller up and down in a circular motion to do this. You might be able to hear it in the air, but I can move side to side by turning the controller. This is what the six axis wanted to be. Like, in its, in its most primal dreams, the 6-axis thought it was this on the PS3, but it never was. Oh, I can't. Okay. Once I make the top, I'll look at the chat again. Perfect. Okay, I got up. I got up there. Nice. I am... <laughs> my arms are sore. That was not easy. All right, what's going on in the chat? What's going on in the chat? Um... Da -na -na -na. Uh, uh, uh. Sorry, just trying to scroll through here to make sure I didn't miss anything. Um, Drake, I don't know where it is now, but I did uh, watch it before. Um... Yeah, apparently Margot Robbie is going to be the star of the next one, but they had wanted to bring back Jack for something as well. 
Hooded Badass, are you liking Cold War? I didn't like how broken it was. And I don't like zombies anymore. Honestly, I really don't. Because I've watched a bunch of gameplay for it, and I'm not going to spoil it, but the Easter egg was just stupid. It seems like they just don't even take it seriously anymore. Maybe they'll improve it, I don't know. It's kind of not, not for me, I guess. How do I get... Oh, okay, maybe I have to get in through here. Yep, puzzle piece, perfect. Okay, this is kind of like the Super Mario, or uh, Mario Sunshine attack with the uh, water pack or whatever it was. How do I... Oh, okay. I guess you have to take out all the helmets? Alright. Got all the helmets. Then that dude will probably jump. Three seventy one. We might as well just go up here. All right, let's just let them do their thing. All right, let them do their thing. Let them do their thing. Perfect. Okay, we didn't even jump. I just took him out. All right. Fair enough. Is that any kind of Easter egg? No, it's just people jumping. They're climbing, alright. So I could go down here. Oh, there's something down here. Oh, is this the... Oh, is this... De this is Demon Souls, guys. That's the... That's the Maiden in Black. And that's the, uh, whatever he's called. the Not the Chosen Undead, but the just the Demon Souls guy. Wait, oh, hey, I didn't even see that. That's neat. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, back porch, I would agree. Uh, the combat in Arkham Knight's probably the best. Laundry basket, what happened to your toe? Yeah, dude, you guys should play this if you ever get a uh, if you ever get a PS5. Pacifica West, you are very kind. I appreciate being your favorite person, but you should probably find a better favorite person. But I appreciate it. Thank you. You guys are some of my favorite people. You're very nice. Almost always, like 99.9% .9 of you are nice, and then you weed out the people that are jerks. So I appreciate it. Alright, we take that out. If you guys are interested in watching me play more games, usually with Nate or T or someone else, but sometimes by myself, you should check out the Let's Play channel. That is in the description down below, Degenerate Plays. Who is this supposed to be? I can't... I want to see the gun. I should know this. Is this Resistance? I actually can't tell, but this might be Resistance. No, oh no, that's the order. Oh, that, that, that's the order, isn't it? 1886. That's pretty cool. I couldn't even tell, though, at first. Ooh, new artifact. Oh! PSVR processor unit. That's awesome. Kind of looks like it's just a PS4. Nobody really knows what goes on in there. <laughs> Zoom in. All these things are really detailed, too. <laughs> Laundry basket, I suck at Portal 2. Uh, Swizzle Prod, I don't know if uh, Friday the 13th will rise. I, I mean, I think it's kind of dead. Also, uh, Humayun, they, people have been vaping out of that thing. Chili Hog, good call. It was Order 1886. Paul, Puddle Jumper, good call. This is actually really fun to find uh, Easter eggs with you guys. Oh, uh, Oisin? Or Oisin? Prior? Um, I did have, like, a funny story about Nightcrawler, the movie. Nate was uh, super excited for that movie when it got announced, right? He was like, oh, Nightcrawler, sick. He thought it was about the character Nightcrawler. He just thought it was about the X-Men. And then when I told him, no, it's, it's about uh, a photographer... 
who follows people around and is creepy. You should have seen the look of disappointment. I don't think I've ever seen someone more disappointed. Alright, so we have to nice, make it there with minimal property damage. Whoa, 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 okay. Walk on this. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. There we go. Okay, wait for him to drop. Perfect. But yeah, oh yeah, sorry, I didn't finish my thought. If you do want to watch more gameplay and stuff, or we do Let's Plays that are really fun, I think, at least to me, uh, you should check out the Let's Play channel. It is in the description down below, Degenerate Plays. We have a really fun time over there. Pretty soon, starting Miles Morales and Demon Souls as well. So, quite a bit going on. Wow, that is evil of me. Did I just murder these people? Huh, okay. Guys, now I'm really like Christopher Columbus. I even have a bow and arrow. What's going on over here? This man helped me, so he will die. I want that rock you're on! Fall! Oh, he doesn't fall. What is the deal with this? This thing. Huh, okay. Guess I'm confused. Is there a way to... Is there a way to latch on to something with this? And I wasn't paying attention. Come on, come back. Okay, I guess that's it. That's how to progress. Actually, this thing's gonna make me lazy, and that may be worse. Take him out. Bang, bang. Do they just keep coming back? No? Okay, perfect. Make sure I didn't miss anything. Doesn't look like I did. Nice. All right, and then we got this dude here. Blow him up. Whoa. Is this a boss fight? Oh, okay, I understand. I can hit it. Alright. Fire. Tired. Perfect. Is that it? No, he's got more. Alright. Move around. Oh, okay. Where's the last? There we go. Perfect. Wait. There we go. Alright, did I miss anything in the chat? Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Too hard to watch everything at once. Uh, I did not watch the Lego Movie 2. Also, people, here's the thing. Here's the thing, Lego, with Joker. Everybody has been taking shots at Joker since it came out. I don't even take it seriously anymore. Hey, Hooded Badass, have a great time. Or have a great day. Thanks for checking it out. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, if I had powers, I would be a superhero because I'd feel too bad, Michael. But I want, like, Logan's powers where I just live forever and I'm depressed all the time. And I have claws. That's what I want. Oh, the healing. Dude, the healing power would be the best power ever. You just get shot, and he gets shot in the head in X-Men 2, and he just gets up a minute later. The bullet just pops out. That's what I want. Healing powers that make you live for a long time. This is Tekken. That one's obvious. Tekken hasn't really been a PlayStation thing on its own for a while, but it's still, it's pretty cool. So what if I shot him off... So then this dude comes back, and then he just knocks him down again. Alright, is there a way to get... Over there? I don't know. Alright. Pull this. Perfect. Oh, back to the monkey. Back to the monkey! Yes! Uh, Nice voltage, you platinumed all the Arkham games. Uh. 
Drake Jackson, what's the best movie I've ever seen? Probably the one that everyone will crap on is Blade Runner The Final Cut. That movie to me is a work of art. But it's like Joker. Everybody who watches it wants to be a contrarian, so certain people love it, certain people don't. It's kind of whatever. <clears throat> Joker's up there, though, for me, too. Yeah, let's shake. Oh, no. Oh, you have to do it softly. Oh! Come on! Oh, jeez. No, grab it. Nice! Oh, the PSVR! Is that the PS5 VR, or maybe there isn't one yet? I think there's just one, isn't there? You guys can see how bad my hand shakiness is from this. Because, like, if I if I set it down, it's, uh, let's see. Perfectly still. So my chronic pain that I have, jeez, my nose is killing me. <clears throat> my chronic pain condition I have makes my hands, like, shaky. It's a little behind the scenes for your boy's terrible body that needs to be replaced by a replica immediately. Alright. Jump. Grab. Down. Jesus, controller's going crazy. Up. Alright. Oh, wait. So if I go down... Oh, I get... Oh, I see. Okay, so the yellow ones give me coins. Oh, oh, no, 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 no! Okay, these guys are... Okay. Come on. Go, 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 go. A lot of concentration. <laughs> Alright, let's just let's see what's going on in the chat. I'm really surprised a hundred of you are here. Thank you. Uh no, I would not want Nate's body. Drake Jackson, I'm way better looking than Nate. Way better looking. Uh let's see. Go, go, go. Perfect. Come on. I gotta swing to the right. Perfect. So I got well, I don't know if I should go this way yet, because it seemed like there was something over by this dude. Is there? No? Oh yeah, puzzle piece. Perfect. But you have to almost you almost have to swing at an angle. So really get going. Then jump, drop, hit, hit, hit. Now I want to go down here. Perfect. Okay, so we got two puzzle pieces out of that just for going the other way. Uh, uh. Go quick, go quick, go quick, go quick, go quick, go quick, quick, quick. See, this is what games should do. You incentivize exploration. I always hated this thing, the PSVR aim controller. Looks so stupid, but it's funny. Alright, shut that. Uh, Yes, Carson, we are playing Demon Souls on Degenerate Plays. It starts tomorrow. What is Gang Beast, really? Is that the one where you go around and fight each other as the little monsters? Uh, 
Yes, thank you, Andrew. Very cool. Uh, Pine Fancy Pants, I haven't played it yet. Uh, I have not played Godfall yet. My favorite comic book movie, Fugitive Gaming, is The Dark Knight Returns. Alright. Let's go down. Okay, there we go. What is yours? What are your guys' favorite comic book movies? Do you have one? I'm gonna wait. Oh no! So you almost have to go one at a time. Maybe you could do more if you're not cautious. Alright, so now we need to watch and wait. Okay, I didn't go quite high enough. On. Oh, why well, I need to move over? Okay. It's hard to do this without moving at all because you... Well, you pretty much have to move to touch the controller. It's kind of confusing. Okay, so if I just don't tilt it at all and I just go like this, maybe? Nice. Okay, perfect. Uh, nope, that's not what I wanted. Nope, I want to get... There we go. Come on. There we go, perfect, 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 perfect. Is this the end of this level? Oh, now we're somewhere else, okay. Oh, he's cold. These guys are building. This was the old PS4 music. Let me turn it on for the base thing, I think. <clears throat> uh... Well, Drake Jackson, how are you going to get Arkham Origins on the PS4? Are you just going to play PS Now? Because PS Now kind of sucks. So no, I guess, if that's your way to do it. I think this is from Journey. That's neat. I think that's what that's from. What is this? Are they trying to... Oh, they're just trying to get out a dude who's frozen. Can I help? No, I guess not. Okay. I tried to help. I tried to be a good person. Oh, these are the analog sticks. That's cool. They move around. Oh, okay. I really like this game down here. Monster escape? Huh, okay. Kind of wish they were playing a real game. Unless that is one and I'm just an idiot and don't know. Is that a PS4? Yeah, it looks like just the PS4. New artifact. PlayStation 4 promised greatness, delivered more. <laughs> yeah, that's not uh, propaganda at all for their own machine, but yeah, it was a great machine. I have the Pro. I kind of hate how it looks. I liked how the original looked better. Hey Kyle, how you doing today? Glad to see you here. Yeah, Cardinal, it was the PS4 startup meme. Isn't that awesome? My favorite Spider-Man movie... Uh, my favorite Spider-Man movie, this is from Weeson Pryor, is uh, probably Spider-Man 2 with Toby. I know that's kind of a basic answer, but that's probably what mine is. Spider-Verse is certain. Oh, hey, here we got all our uh, artifacts so far. So I wonder if these are artifacts from the PS4 era. And if there's more from other eras or something like that. All right, let's do the, uh... come on, crush it, there we go. What is this? Just, is that an artifact? 
He's holding a PS2, playing with the DualShock 2. That's awesome. Crush it. What is this? New artifact. What, oh! PlayStation Portable Microphone. You know, one thing that's cool about this is, one, a lot of people have these things still, but two, this is a really fun way for PlayStation collectors to kind of immortalize their stuff, you know, digitally. I mean, you get to collect this stuff, have fun with it, uh, you sort of have like a digital gallery. It's pretty neat. Um... I'm doing good, Kyle. Blood Demon Guy. Uh, yeah, the original PS4 looks better. So the Pro plays better, but the original looks better. That's kind of the issue I have. I actually think the same with the Xbox One X. Oh, here's the Pro. Yeah, you can see, I mean, here's the problem with this thing. It looks like a sandwich. If you look, it looks like two pieces of bread and then munch meat or something in the middle. I don't know. It's fine. It looks fine, but it's just kind of... Land. Kind of looks like a Roku or something. I actually really like how the PS5 looks. I wonder if that's in here. It's got to be, right? Crush this. Puzzle piece. Okay. Puzzle piece. I'm assuming this is all these coins are good for. Uh, just them sitting at a loading screen. That's cool. Alright, this is all we get. Just a can? Alright. All right, so what do we got here? The Pro. Yeah, that must be the PS4 generation. All right, we'll see where we can head to next. I'm having a lot more fun than I thought I was going to. Oh, he loves the PS4. I do too, buddy. I do too. This guy loves the Pro. He's like, mine's better. Look at my sandwich. I don't know what he's doing to that thing. Did this PlayStation consent to that touch? Get out of here. You've been canceled by Twitter. That's the that's uh, the car from the movie Cars. I was going to call him John McClane, Lightning McQueen. I don't know what I'm saying. I had like a... Flavored water here. I haven't drinking any of this whole time. Ugh. Oh, well, that's odd. New speedrun challenges are available from CPU Plaza. Can you climb conquer the clock? Or can your climbing conquer the clock? Can you conquer the clock? Um... Yeah, I don't want to say goodbye to the PS4 either. I'm still going to play it. Guys, so here's the thing. I'm not I'm not saying this as a humble brag. People think it sounds douchey when you talk about this. I bought these things over many years, saving a lot of money. Um, and living at home, helping take care of my dad and stuff, so I didn't need to pay rent. But, set up right now, and I have to switch out HDMI ports on the back, but set up right now on my media stand are my PS3, PS4 Pro, and PS5, my Xbox 360 that was my dad's, my Wii U, my Nintendo Switch, my Xbox One X, and my Retron 5, which plays Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color, uh, Game Boy SNES, NES, Famicom, Super Famicom, Genesis, and Master System games. All on, all on the, uh, I don't know, Entertainment Center. Because I love playing old games. You know, when I get the new generation of games, I'm not like, well, see a chump to the old gen. I still play them. You know, I still play them. So, I don't know. That's my recommendation. You guys, uh, I mean, you, you got to do whatever you got to do. Like, if you need to sell the system for money or something, totally get it. Or if you just love new games, I totally get it. But I will say this. My personal advice is that the older you get, I feel like you end up loving games more for being fun and games versus just the impressive tech. Like, look, this is super fun, right? I love this. I'm having a great time. You know what else I'd be having a great time right now playing? Uh, 
Pokemon Emerald from the Game Boy Advance, you know, because they're both just fun games. And so it just kind of ends up being like whatever you're in the mood for. I think there's too much push in the gaming market, like, oh, I gotta, I gotta get the newest thing and I gotta keep up. You know, no, you don't have to. You really don't. You can play whatever is fun to you. I still play my PS3. I still play my Game Boy Advance. I still play, you know, I, I don't know, all this stuff. I play old games on my PC even. Just depends on what I want to play. But I, I totally get it. It is weird for them to stop making games at some point for the thing, but you can still play them. There's still games on the PS3 that are great that aren't really on anything else, and you're... I guess you can play them on PS Now, but I really think PS Now is bad, so why would you? For example, God of War Ascension. I tried to play that on PS Now compared to on my... Oh, jeez, that's terrifying. Compared to on my PlayStation 3... And it looks horrible on PS Now. And that was on the PS4 Pro. And I have like 500 megabits a second internet. So it's pretty good. Um, and PS Now just kind of sucks for it. So until some of that old stuff gets brought up, and some of it never does, you really just kind of have to play and enjoy whatever you want. However new or old it is, I guess, to me. Alright, okay. Oh, jeez. All right, it's getting kind of difficult. Perfect. Uh, is this Fez? I can't tell if this is Fez. Maybe it is. I don't know. I kind of hate that game after uh, what's his name, Phil Fish, was such a dick. I, I guess I don't hate the game, but the creator was such a prick in my opinion. And he even said like, "I'm taking the money and run running for Fez 2. And someone said, hey, uh, you know, isn't that ridiculous that you're literally pocketing the money you made and just not making our game even though you promised it and it was almost done? And he's like, wow, entitled gamer much? It's like, okay. I hate people like that. It's stupid. Hey, Sophia, and we are excited to play through Miles. I'm waiting for that, uh, I'm waiting for that, uh, copyright to be solved. Okay, so too indecisive to pick a name. PS Now is essentially Netflix for games. That's how it's been marketed without saying it. So the idea is that I can stream games from previous generations right to my console off the internet. The problem is there's issues with lag, there's issues with the game not looking good. And I, I'm not just saying that as like a graphics elitist or something. You can see the pixels. It'll be like square blocks on the screen sometimes. It just looks bad. And I, I don't like it. Also, is this from, um, not Mag, what was that game? It was like Zelda, kind of, and you would make things. 3D.Heroes, is that what that's from? Maybe you guys can tell me. I, or I'm just not recognizing it. Uh, and yeah, Mandalorian, that makes sense with the PS4. I mean, the thing is that there are going to be a few games that probably aren't playable, but it'll just depend on if those are ones you care about. Because the list hasn't been finalized yet, and I think they said out of the 4,500 games that are out now, they want around 4,000 of them to be playable. Which, I suppose if those 500 games are not things people care about, it doesn't matter at all. I have no idea what they are. One thing I will say that's stupid is PT is not playable on uh, PS5. They purposely made it not playable. So, I'm seriously keeping my PS4 just because of PT, mainly. So, even if even if I wasn't a console collector, I would just keep it for that. But that's me, you know, a big Silent Hill fan. Um, which not everyone is, and I guess has become pretty niche, considering how bad my video on it did. Uh, oh. Come on, drop. Perfect, drop. Perfect. Alright, once we get up here... Wait, so I want to see what's down here. Maybe you guys told me what that uh, what that was. Kyle K with the Super Chat, thank you very much. Hey Jay, have you ever played Hollow Knight? No, but I watched uh, Korra play it. Oh, knocked down my water. Korra, who is Doodle, in the chat. I watched her play it. Mm -mm -mm. I have not played Arkham Knight on the PS5. Is it improved at all? I don't know, Michael. Maybe you guys will know. Uh, Drake Jackson, I finished Marvel Spider-Man on my own. I just haven't played it 
on the channel, but we plan to eventually. Marvel Nerd, I will try to remember that your name is Josh, but here's the thing, there is a lot of people, so it's kind of hard. Uh, Hollow Knight could be so fun and rage-inducing at times. Shake and Bake, yeah, it looked like it. You know, I got it for free, so I thought about playing it um, at some point. Is this man drowning this other man? Look, he's pretending to help. He's like, no, no, I'm helping. He's like the Angel of Death type thing. Oh, this looks like it's... Uh... Oh, yeah, that's what that is. Um, the Kojima game. Um, Death Stranding. Look, he's even got the little baby! This is seriously one of the most adorable games I have ever played in my life. I love this. Can I get more coins? Oh, I can. Okay. See, this game does teach a valuable lesson about abusing animals and getting money for it. There's plenty of YouTubers that do that, so it must work, right? Wait a minute, can I... Come on. Wait, ah, crap. Whatever, I, I messed up. I messed up, I gotta do it quicker. Do it over here. Close enough. Alright, what is this? Oh, did I not say thank you to Kyle for the super chat, by the way? Thank you, Kyle. I do appreciate it if I didn't say thank you. Uh, yes. Fugitive Gaming, I have played Star Wars Fallen Order. I love it. Uh, there's things I hope they improve in the sequel, but overall I was a big fan. I want that letter. Give it to me. What is this? Is, was there like a... Uh, maybe, I feel like I'm not getting that one. Okay, so the cloud there pushes that. Oh, that's a controller. That's cute. Now it's a original PlayStation. Okay, we made it. How do we fight this? Oh, I see. Okay. Rip its head off. That is graphic. Perfect. Oh, that's timed. Okay. Oh, no! Alright. We will brave on. Oh, jeez. Oh, I got an umbrella. It's raining. Alright, sorry if I'm not doing a good enough job watching the chat here. I'm, like, really entranced by this experience. It sounded sarcastic, but I'm actually having a really fun time. <laughs> Oh, you can feel the little raindrops hitting the controller. This is... Okay, well, that was my stupid mistake. That I should have known what I was doing there. Back porch uh, downloads are really fast for the most part. However, um, it depends on your internet, obviously. I think it's faster than the PS4. But certain things are not automatic. So, for example, I reinstalled Modern Warfare on here, and it didn't download all the DLC for it all those packs, so I had to download some of them manually. So I'm not sure how it'll work for things that used to be on the PS4. Maybe that's a mainstay, like maybe that's normal. But uh, it was obnoxious, so I hope not. That was the thing, was there were certain games they said that they can't guarantee how they would run from the PS4. Oh, it's the Origami Killer from uh, Heavy Rain. Oh, and it's raining. Okay, I get it. That's awesome. Let's get in here. This dude's wiping himself. Okay, well, that was inappropriate. Let me sniff that towel, please. Oh, what is this? Oh, okay, I just have to... Well, that was simple. Alright, never mind. I thought that was going to be much more complicated than it was. 
I've been doing this for a while on everybody, because it's just kind of the easiest way to kill them, so. Alright. Chat, 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 chat. Uh... <laughs> Cardinal, you are right. Yeah, that thing takes up way too much space. Also, the SSDs that you need to down or that you need to expand your storage well are way too much money right now on the PS5, so that's one negative. Alright. Because you can expand it with other stuff, but the problem is that um, enhanced games, it's weird, it's... There's like weird stipulations to this stuff you guys will have to look into. It's impossible for me to explain it, but the, the expanded storage thing's weird. It's even weirder on Xbox, in my opinion, because it's like they make it so that on Xbox the enhanced games don't run enhanced if they're on external hard drive versus internal. So I don't know if I really agree with the way that they've done the uh, memory expansion for this generation at all. And you know what? I will say straight up, I made a video about this and I still believe it. It is ridiculous that it was not at least one terabyte base for both of these things. Because it wasn't. It was like a um, 800 gigabytes and close to a terabyte for the Xbox. Oh, okay, I have to... I didn't even realize I had to turn that. So I have to move this with the touchpad. It's kind of like Super Monkey Ball. Okay, move back. Now oh, what's going on over here? Who's this? Is this just MLB The Show? Yeah. Looks like it. pins over there. What is this over here? Who is that? It's not Fat Princess. I don't think. I don't know. Oh. Alright. It's weird to control. Hmm. Alright, we head over here. Nice, we got a strike. Wait, what if who answers Nate? And yeah, back porch, I completely agree with that. It's it's ridiculous. The storage space is the most ridiculous thing on this generation. It's I would honestly venture to say it's just stupid. What happens if I... Oh, I can't turn them all on. Okay, let's go through here. I feel like I'm doing this really poorly. And it probably doesn't help if I stop to see what every Easter egg is. What is this? What are they doing? Are they just having a good time? That's it? That guy's drunk on popcorn? Okay. Alright, move down here. I'm kind of tired of the ball. I'd like to play as a person again. Oh no! Come on! Come on! Do I have to hit this pin hard enough? Oh, okay. I thought I was not going to make that. What's over here? Oh no, oh no, okay. Well, that was terrifying. Uh, 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 are you guys just having... Wow, okay, I would need to pay better attention. Fat Princess was a old PlayStation exclusive. Dude, Meat Canyon is terrifying. And yeah, Jill, I agree. Storage is ridiculous on the Switch. You basically have to buy an external uh, memory for the Switch. It's it's actually pathetic. Okay, so I need to go really slow here. Okay, come back, please. It's 
Stop, 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 stop! Ooh, artifact. Oh, Astrobot. Is this a real game? They fix that, all right. What are they telling me? Same thing, okay. I guess. Oh, okay, I see. down here. Um, oh wow, I actually managed to get them all. I'm kind of terrified now. We'll just leave that one. That reminds me of the old DS, like on games like Nintendogs, where you had to talk to it and blow into the microphone. Drake, yeah, I, th I think I missed a couple artifacts, sadly. Drake Jackson, yeah, I'd still make videos if I was a millionaire. I might not make them every, like, quite as often, because it'd be nice to get a little more time to myself. Which I don't really get much of, believe it or not. Like, the amount of hours I put into this is more than I put into any job ever in my life. And I was a teacher. So... Oh, okay. Okay, I thought he died. Oh, jeez, that is brutal. Holy cow, you get, like, inflated and then you explode. I just really want to go back and get more artifacts. Pull that. Wait for this guy. Okay. You do your thing. Punch you. Good. I got him. Uh, do you guys believe that it was self- Oh, is that Ace Combat? Because Ace Combat's been like a PlayStation thing forever. I know it's gotten multi-platform now, and it had one Xbox exclusive game, I think. Which I own six, I think, or seven. Um, what was I going to ask you guys? I, I had a question for you. Oh yeah, do you think it's selfish that Nate wants to spend today with his wife and doesn't want to come over and help me record for free? Don't you guys think that's selfish? Let me know in the chat. I do. Why? Why is Nate pretending he has a life and a wife, for for that matter? Well, that must be another area, right? No, there's two two whole separate areas. Well, I don't want to progress the level. Uh, I actually, uh, Oasis, I actually have, um, I actually have Crash Team Racing on the PS4. I bought it yesterday, believe it or not. Have you guys noticed the Black Friday deals this year are just terrible? Oh, is that Sekiro? Or is that Go no, that's Ghost of Tsushima. Ghost of Tsushima. That's cool. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. I didn't know that that happened. Well, we know now. We live and we learn. I completely agree, Cardinal. He's a very selfish man. Take this out. Punch Ghost of Tsushima. So once you step on those, they just go away, I guess, over time. So you kind of have to step, do your thing, then get out. See, this the sucky thing is I think this is just going to progress the level, but I don't know. What is, wait, what is this thing? I've never seen this. 
PS1 LCD monitor? Okay, well, maybe could you turn the other way? Well, I want to see it. Why is it turning that way? Whatever, we'll look at it like that, I guess. I'm holding my controller straight, and it's like this. Uh, well, we'll look at it back on the main menu, I guess. That's the path to heaven, actually. We're gonna take a screenshot of that. That's pretty cool. That is the other most annoying thing. You guys have no idea, and I get this is a first world problem, but I can't turn off the screenshot thing. So if I take a screenshot, look at the upper right corner. This pops up every time. I've turned off all notifications. I've turned off all pop-up notifications. That's how we're not getting any of these. Like, even though I've been doing some achievement stuff or trophy stuff or whatever, that's why we're not really seeing it. We can see they're in progress if we go here. But that's what I'm saying is that I've turned off all that stuff, right? But it doesn't matter because for some reason... On this system, unlike the PS4, there's no way to turn off screenshot notifications. So if I'm playing a game and I take it while I'm streaming or while I'm recording a Let's Play or whatever, it just pops up. And it might seem like nothing, but it is very obnoxious. Oh, I got enough. Oh, okay. Oh. Perfect, we made it. Run, 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 grab. Anyway, hopefully that's fixed in an update, because it's just frustrating, because if I'm doing a Let's Play or something, I don't want that to pop up every 10 seconds. That is not the end of a level path, but that... Actually, I can't even tell. The other one might be. Who knows? Okay, go this way. Kill this dude. These guys drop down. Oh! Well, that's a first. Kyle, thank you for the super chat. I appreciate it. Nate's starting to lose funny. I agree, because he's not even here. Where'd he go? Uh, T did have his surgery. It went fine. He's recovering now. So, we will see how long that will take, but yes, it went fine. Thank you for asking. I went the wrong way. Yeah, he is at home recovering. He can't be around anyone for a couple weeks, actually, because of, um... Oh, alright. Because of, essentially, the potential for him to get sick or get an infection, and also he can't move, so he's not even supposed to walk for now because he had, like, a foot surgery. And they said to wait, um, wait like a week and a half at least before leaving his house even. This dude gonna drop. There we go. Come on. Flip. Oh, so that one does it twice as fast. Okay. It's all learning. It's all learning. Thank you for asking, though. Tito's appreciate all the well wishes. Boy, I suck at this part. Holy cow. I cannot really do a Deadpool impression, Michael Myers. I suck at it. I'm really bad. Shake and bake, what Joker voice do you want? Like, I'm the Joker, baby! Like that? Like, I can't really... I can't do the Joker very well. I feel like you guys think I'm good at impressions, and I'm awful at them. I don't I don't know what you're looking for. Except for this one. I'm a little good at Heath Ledger. You know, when I was playing Astro's Playroom, nobody batting an eye, but now that Jay's playing it, everyone's losing their minds. Is that Sekiro? I don't like Sekiro. Actually, I do. I'm just being a contrarian. I'm the Joker. Kyle, you think my Joker impression was good, the previous one? 
PlayStation Multitap. I don't know what this... Oh, yeah, okay, I do know what this is, where you could add multiple controllers. That's cool. At the right angle. I wish games that made... Gosh dang it. I wish games that made paid games, right? Like games that you have to... Do I have to do that all again? That's so dumb. Games that you have to pay for. I wish they put as much care into this as these guys did. Because a lot of them don't. Like, I'm sorry, I, I actually enjoy Marvel's Avengers. But if you look at that game, it doesn't even have the charm that this game has. And it's working with one of the biggest IPs in the world. Like a billion dollar IP. Alright, so we get this. So yeah, you must have to again. So, I really should... I really should go to this checkpoint again, just so that it's saved. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Okay, I did. We head this way. Get this guy to drop. That would be perfect. Dead. Dead. This is where I'm regretting not taking my allergy medicine this morning, too, because I feel like I sound awful today. Oh, that dude's just listening to music. That's pretty dope. Are these Sony TVs? Uh, okay, well, fair enough. I stopped to look at the TV. T had to get a... Uh, like a bone part removed from his foot because it was affecting his walking and could affect his walking more as he got older. You know, Kyle, I love Spider-Man Dying Wish. I also love, um... Oh, let me look it up real quick. Sorry, I'm, I'm just gonna use Google for a second. It is in... What? Wait, what is this? I'm trying to find what issue this is. It was during Back in Black. Uh, Sensational Spider-Man Volume 2, Number 40. It's just a comic book, but it's the one where Peter Parker meets the one above all. Which is basically Marvel Universe's God. It's really cool. It's really a cool comic. Sensational Spider-Man Volume 2, Issue 40. It's really good. It's about self-doubt and, like, a bunch of other stuff and loss. It's really cool. It's too bad that they had to tarnish it by immediately going into crap, like, one more day and all this dumb garbage. Peter Parker can't be married. Then kids won't like him because he's not relatable. This stupid argument. Seriously, they got rid of MJ and Peter's marriage, which was good at the time. It was done well. I don't even care for their relationship anymore in the comics because it's so dragged out now. But their marriage was done pretty well up to that point. And they got rid of it because they were like, Well, if Peter Barker's married, no one will relate to him. Who, who would relate to a married man? These are children reading our books. Which, by the way, not true. Misconception. Most comic book readers are teenagers to adults. And if they're on the adult side, a lot of them are older because they grew up with it, and it's legacy media. Like, I'm sorry, I love comics, but it is sort of a legacy media because this is... Come on, I want to take out all these pins. Um, come on. Because we're talking about print books, and a lot of kids don't buy print books. I'm sorry, they just don't. Nice, okay, puzzle piece, got it. No, I'm just gonna wait for this. Oh, okay, you have to, oh, okay, you actually have to be moving. Nice. So that's gone. What happens if you go in here? Oh, okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, okay, never mind. Well, I guess we're just getting moved. Oh, 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 wait, 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 I want the puzzle piece. Oh, okay. Oh, is that a dead end? Let's just... 
Let's risk it. Let's just check it out. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. The thing. I feel like I'm playing Mario on Rainbow Road, but worse. Oh, no. Oh, I thought I had it. Yeah, I agree, Kyle. Most comic book readers are teens to adults. They are. 100%. So for them to say, like, Peter Parker is not relatable if he has a wife. Okay, well, that time I just sucked. It's ridiculous. What video she can make? Oh. Um. I'd love to go to Ireland, Oasis. I'd love to go all over the world, but I don't know when it would work out, you know? Uh, the pandemic, and also me having no money. Kind of a lot of roadblocks right now to traveling. And a lot of people who shame you for doing it, too. Is that the PS1 controller? Yeah, the DualShock. The original. Oh, they even have all the engravings on it. That's cool. Go this way very carefully. Oh no! Oh, okay, that was literally my fault. There's no excuse for that. I was just being an idiot. Alright, we can just get. Oh, okay, too fast. Good thing there's no limit to lives in this. Uh, yeah, William Anderson. Our streams don't get that many viewers. I've kind of considered moving them to degenerate plays. I'm not sure. I've considered it, but I'm not sure what I'll do. Also, I think a lot of people don't know what this game is, and sadly the way things work is that if people don't know what something is, instead of checking it out, they just tune out. Uh, brand recognition, that's why it's so big. New artifact, I've never seen that thing. It looks like for the original PlayStation, the Pocket Station. Alright, so this is literally making me want to go to eBay and buy stuff. Like, I want that. I don't know what that does, I don't care, I want it. Reminds me of the VMU from the Dreamcast. Just kind of let this do its thing. Take me wherever you're going to take me. Is that it? That was the level? No, not quite. Was this a boss fight? I took a screenshot. That is awesome! Aww, oh, this game is, like, nostalgia-inducing. What happens if I push this button? Anything? No. Okay. You know what I remember this from? I used to play LEGO Rock Raiders so much on the PS1. I don't know if anyone even knows what that is anymore. And they're all sitting here playing. Uh, I'm telling you, nostalgia is a powerful drug. It's the PS1? I thought I already had the PS1. Huh. That's dope. I don't know why I already thought I had that. Yeah, that was really cool, Tony. I love it. Yeah, so... Kingdom Come Superman. <clears throat> You're not gonna get in trouble for admitting that. And I don't care. But I'm concerned with the comic book industry because the problem is... Everything's too expensive. And people have to do that, right? Like, lots of people have to read it online. And back in the day, like when my dad was a kid, you could go buy comics for 10 cents a piece or less. Like there was a grocery store near him that sold comic books. You could buy a stack of comic books for 25 cents. You know, you could buy Superman, you could buy Looney Tunes, whatever you wanted. And they sold tons of them. Now comics are like $5 a piece and they can't even sell a handful. It's bad. Um, 
I don't really plug other channels very much other than Alex Podcast now because I love him. He's my bro. And we do a lot of stuff together. But if you guys want to see some stuff about the current state of the comic book industry, you should really check out uh, Clownfish TV. They do a lot of stuff about it, which is really interesting because the comic book industry is suffering hard right now. DC has lost multiple um, distributors in terms of getting their comics out there. Uh, the quarantine has affected things. Some people have estimated it sped up the death of the comic book industry by five years because it was already suffering. So, oh, they have the original PS3 there. I literally love that thing. So, and they've done some analysis of it, and it's really interesting, I think. Some people really don't like them because they just kind of, I think they just kind of say it how it is. People don't like that, but I do. If you guys are looking for some um, fairly cheap, though, stuff to read, you can find the, the Scott Snyder Batman run. Like, the first three volumes, at least, are pretty cheap. That's cool. Also, the uh, Dark Knight's Metal and Dark Knight's Metal Rising are both great stories written by Scott Snyder. Not that I only read him, but he does great work. I think the original Superior Spider-Man runs really good by Dan Slott. It's one of the few things by Dan Slott I really like. Oh, this is the old PSP. Yeah, or the Go. I have enough for one more. That's the pop can, of course. Alright, what do we get here? Some stuff in that gen couple puzzle pieces. Nice. That's pretty simple. I'm probably going to stop streaming soon because, uh, I don't know, I'm kind of, well, I mean, it's been an hour, 45 minutes, probably, almost. So I might play a little bit more. Uh, trophy list for this game. Um, I mean, we can look at it. Trophies. Well, apparently I already have 12%. There's an add-on for this? Huh. I don't really want to look at all the hidden ones, but, um, a lot of them are just, like, cleared SSD Speedway, cleared Cool Springs, cleared Memory Meadow... Got all artifacts and cooling. Got all artifacts in GPU jungle. So some of these I'm going to have to go back for if I decide to do the platinum. Which I probably will. This is a really fun game. Dude Raider. Collected all artifacts in the four main stages and the PlayStation Labo. Wow. Puzzle pieces and cool springs. Puzzle pieces, puzzle pieces, puzzle pieces. Got a secret gotcha. Um... Got all gotcha prizes. So the gotcha prizes are what I was just doing. Nice thing about this is they show you progress. So if you look at what I'm looking at, this Saru gotcha trophy, 33% of the way there. So we know that we have a third of those. Uh, send 10 bots flying. I mean, we start to get into more like hidden stuff, which punch the PS logo on the PS2 in the PlayStation Labo. So I don't know. There's like some hidden stuff, juggling balls. Something I specialize in. Fell 99 feet and caught yourself in the GPU jungle. Yeah, they're pretty simple. I like how the trophies look, too. They all look like a computer chip. It's a really charming game. But yeah, so far, I've only been playing these few games. Astro's Playroom for PS5. I've been playing Astro's Playroom, Miles Morales, and Demon Souls. That's really it. And I just started Astro's today with you guys. So, I haven't really played this much. I have Godfall, but I haven't played it yet. Um, I bought it the other day, and I just have not had time to play it. But, it'll happen. Knock over the desk. That's cool. Oh no, now he has to pick them all up. This is adorable, guys. Oh, 
Oh, you can open it. Wait, can you... Oh, wait, can you turn that on? And then... I wanna know if I could flip the disc into there. That would be amazing. Doesn't look like it, but I want it to. Alright, let's shut that. If we go in here, can you see anything? Oh, you can! Try to turn on the PS4? I will go see what it does. Might as well. I mean, here's the prow. Oh, you can! Can you eject a disc? Well, you could hear it start up, too. So what about the original? Where'd the original go? Am I losing my mind? I know I... Oh, it's over there. Okay. Well, it's already on. The original's already on. I can see if I can turn it off. You can. I don't think you can really eject anything from it, though, because there's nothing in it. Oh, cool! Yeah, so all these are really kind of interactable. Which is really surprising to me. I would think you would just unlock them and then that'd be it. But no, you can interact with them. Which is sick. Uh, the PS5 startup theme, theme is not really that memorable. It's, it's kind of hard to describe, though. Aqua, I'm not far into this game at all. I just, the hour and 45 minutes I played here, that's it so far. Does this turn on? Aww. I love it. This probably doesn't because it's not turned on or not plugged into anything, but I don't know. This dude seems to love this. Uh. Hey, Michael Myers, have a fantastic day. I'm glad you made it. I'm probably going to stop here in a minute anyway. Have a fantastic day. I know, I agree, Fugitive Gaming. This, this game is amazing. I love it. I honestly love it. Which I just did not expect myself to say of a free game. Why am I so tired today? But yeah, so if you have enjoyed the stream, I feel like I should have ended this better. I don't feel like I did very much, but I guess it was it was just a chill stream anyway. We were all just hanging out. Um, if you have enjoyed the stream, the link in the description, I think it's the top link actually, is to the Let's Play channel where we play through a ton of games together and have a good time. We're going to be starting some PlayStation 5 stuff soon. Like, for example, we are starting Miles Morales. Whenever I get the stupid copyright uh, issue I'm having with it solved, which is really annoying. And we are going to be playing uh, Demon Souls as well, starting tomorrow. So, Spider-Man will either be up tonight or tomorrow at the latest. I need to wait and see if the copyright gets sorted. If it does, I can put it up tonight. And if it doesn't, I need to re-edit part of it, re-export it. That will take me hours to do, and then I will have to put it up tomorrow. So it just depends on how cooperative the YouTube editor is today. So we will see. But I would say check it today if you're interested. Degenerate Plays in the description down below. I do hope to kind of see you guys there. I know it's not a live stream, but it is pretty much the same thing. We just hang out. Usually it's me and Nate or me and T. 
we play through games. Sometimes we go back and answer comments and stuff as well in new videos and just kind of have a good time, you know? I've considered moving the streams there, and I might actually take a poll eventually to see, because maybe it would fit better on that channel, and I'm not sure really, but I guess probably no one cares but me in terms of where I put these things. I have no idea. Oh! So this... I already have that, but I'll take the coins. Oh, that sucks. Is that an actual puzzle piece? Or Yeah, it is. Okay. I do want to get that before I stop. Not going to make it? Oh, I made it. Okay. Nice. Fall damage? Nope. Alright, I'm going to say my goodbyes to you guys in the chat. Yes, T is my friend who does videos with me. Uh, also, I appreciate it. Okay. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Um, Colin, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thanks for hanging out. Kyle, I appreciate you as well. You think I should what? Oh, you think it would grow the channel well, the other one? Yeah, maybe I should do some live streams over there. That's a good idea. I probably will do that. Maybe um, it might even be better for me to do my own Let's Plays, you know, like just me for some of them too. But I'll probably still do some on this channel too. So anyway, if you guys can check out that channel, I appreciate it. Thank you for all the help from the mods. Jill, I know Cora was here earlier. Michael, Lego, thank you guys. Andrew was here before he had to go to work. So I appreciate all of you. I hope you all have a fantastic day. And as always, stay shway, do something fun. You know, enjoy yourself, relax. People have been too angry lately. Don't fall into it. I'll see you later.